I just want to see what's over the ridge. Oh! Oh, are you freaking serious? <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of The Isle, where today I have spawned in on the Isle Official Dev 3. Because unfortunately, the server that I made my Allosaurus on, which was Tapkin something, was a Russian server, and it is gone. Like, I, I, for the last week I've been trying to get on it and it's never shown up. I don't know what what exactly happened. I think it was a private server and they did what they wanted to do and it vanished. So along with it, so did my Allosaurus, which sucks so much because we were I was wanting to do one more episode, a final episode as a fully grown adult and just end it somehow. The body I've lost. The comrades I've lost. Won't stop hurting. It may come back up as long as the server's not wiped and that way we'll be able to play it. But uh, for now, what I decided to do is the clever thing, actually. You'll be very impressed with me. I decided to join a very low populated server, although it's actually, it seems to be a few people joining now. And I'm playing as a Triceratops. I'm playing as a herbivore because I'm assuming herbivores were a harder sort of thing to um, play as. So if there's less people, there's less carnivores. So I should be able to get up to a decently sized uh, Triceratops. I'm hoping. I heard a T-Rex roar quite close to me. Um, I don't know how, like, herbivores operate. So I'm just gonna, like, bump into every tree. Yeah, there we go. Oh. So ones that look like that. Ones that look like maple leaves. Okay, got it. Because I get a lot of requests to play as um as the baby or like herbivores in general so i don't see why i shouldn't to be honest <laughs> they're loads of fun it's just a shame when nobody takes pity on a young herbivore if you're a carnivore nobody's there to be like oh you're cute they're all just gonna kill you <laughs> if you're a baby carnivore they're like oh bless him he thinks he's deadly i don't know it's night I do not want to be caught out in the open because I heard a fully grown T-Rex roar not too far away from me. And he, unless he's re a really nice chap, maybe he's Captain Teacup, and maybe they'll take pity on me. Chances are they're probably not going to. Well, that's that's me. Check. I've checked my Instagram. I've checked my Twitter. <laughs> so it seems like as a herbivore, oh, yum, yum, yums. Um, you need to eat a lot, but your thirst doesn't go down too much, which is actually really good because it's the bodies of water that mean that you, um, you have to coincide with a lot of carnivores. So I'm just going to eat my fill. There you go. And we're going to sit back down. And now I can play Jurassic World alive. <laughs> oh, yep. There it is. Okay, it has turned sort of day. And it also seems like the T-Rex that's nearby, or was nearby me, also hasn't moved away either. However, I am running out of uh, water. So I'm going to have to find some water around here somewhere. If I'm caught out in the open, I'm going to be dead. So I'm going to talk a lot. So if I do die, well, this episode's quite long. Okay, well, this forest has served me well. Oh my god, look at me. I look like a, um, a British bulldog. <laughs> oh god, it's horrendous what humans have done to dog breeds, isn't it? There's a certain um, name for dogs that have short noses. And you think, right, every dog breed in existence right now, the Chihuahua, the Pug, the, the Bulldog, all descended from a wolf. It's amazing what selective breeding can do, isn't it? Blasphemy! Ah. <laughs> so this is where I heard the T-Rex roar come from. Like, over this way. But the thing is, I I, I honestly don't know um, where where to go. Like, where, where things are. Um, where water is, more importantly. Again, like I said, I really don't want to be caught out. Just because if a carnivore sees me, he can sprint across the map and get to me. A progression tree? No, no. Who remembers the red plants and the blue plants? Oh, them were the days. 
when you could level up as a herbivore like super quick. Oh, I see a T-Rex. Oh, I see a T-Rex. Oh God, thank God he's all the way over there. There's also something else over there. Can you see that? It might be dead, whatever it is. Oh my God, there's only like 20 people on here. And of course there's a freaking T-Rex next to me. And you know, if I run in the opposite direction of the T-Rex, it put some distance between us. Well, I can smell my footprints, that's for sure. Oh, green! Green! <laughs> green tree! Come to papa! Really, water is what's driving me at the moment, so I'd rather find water than go for that green tree. You know, you can get water from eating, right? That would be better. Like, you can, you can definitely get water from leaves. I feel like this may be the first time that, uh... I might die <laughs> due to thirst. Usually it's food. 0.91. All I need to do is just drink a little bit of water and I could get there. I, I definitely can't get it without drinking water though. I can't grow. I'm approaching the edge of the map and I could be out of options to get back to water. There's got to be some. There'll, there'll be a little patch, right? Right in the corner. A little puddle for me. I got a bit scared there because I thought that was um, that was a carnivore or something, but I'm almost 100% sure now that that is my stomach killing me. It looks like time could be over for this little triceratops. See, this is the problem. Unless you know the map, you don't know where the water is. I mean, food's everywhere. Oh god, yep, yeah, one more and I think I'm pretty much gone. Ah! <laughs> no! Anything! God damn it, they made him out with like zero water. I think I just went away from the water, didn't I? I was like, yep, nap, sod it. Oh, I can hear things. Oh, there's a there's a T-Rex. Yeah, there's like a baby T-Rex over there. You know what? Yeah, like that was it. If I went over there, there's just T-Rexes everywhere. This is the problem. People just spawn in as carnivores. Thing is, when things die... You can get- you can get food from them. It's just water for me. I mean, if I go over there, that's probably where the water is. 100% the water's over there. But there's just too much blood. There's too much blood. Too little thirst. Too late. I'm close! I just want to see what's over the ridge. A little Gallimimus or something. Oh! Oh, are you freaking serious? <laughs> Yeah, he's seen me, 100%. Is he gonna get me? Is he gonna get me? Have mercy, please! I just need some water. It's all I want. Just a little bit. Oh, thank you. Oh, Lord. Oh, I love you, Mr. T-Rex. Oh, hello. Hello. Please? Please, no. I'm just really thirsty. I'm just like, look at me. I'm almost dead. You could see the scars. Have mercy. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Friendly. Yes. I'll be your pet. I'll do anything you want. <laughs> Sound like a little goat. Oh. Why? <laughs> what? I will remember you. Oh, for God's sake. After all that, this is why you don't place a herb before in the aisle. Because all the bodies of water are guarded by carnivores. By the time you get there, you're freaking done. <laughs> and there'll be some people in the comments saying, well, maybe you should have just grabbed some water then ran. Look, I didn't even see that T-Rex come on me. <laughs> come up to me. <laughs> there was no chance. The only thing I've got to do is like get lucky and find some water that um, like isn't guarded. A little pool that's somewhere and just live by that. Although that was one of those little po like bodies of water, but it had two 
T-Rexes by it. Two of the buggers. And there's only 21 people on here. Everybody else is probably going to be a carnivore as well. <laughs> oh, it's so frustrating. So my mission now is to find some water that isn't guarded by T-Rexes and uh, survive on that. Already thought about the name for this episode. The little trike that couldn't. Too friendly for my own good is my problem. Should have just bolted as soon as he started drinking. Chances are he would have caught up to me in two seconds though. Giving me false hope. This is where I belong. In the woods. In the outdoors. If only I transformed into like a juvia then impaled that T-Rex. God damn it. Well, this all goes downhill. That must mean there's water down there. I best be careful. <gasps> oh, Ceratosaurus. Oh God, bolt it. Bolt, bolt, bolt. Hide. Lie down. Low. Woo! Ceratosaurus. No. He can't see me, right? No, he can't see me. Just stay still. Stay still. Oh! <laughs> yes! Oh, there he goes! Oh no. Oh good. Oh good. That was lucky. <laughs> That was really like- Oh god, where's he going? Oh no, he's seen me, I think. He's charging. He's gonna charge towards me, isn't he? I think he's seen me. Oh, what's he doing? What's he doing? Please don't. Please don't. Come on, have mercy. Ha have a little bit of mercy. Oh, he was not with that Utah. Okay, I'm up. Time to go. Water. Yes. Oh my God. Lots of it. Oh, that's a safer option. I'll stay in these trees. Go for that. But yes. I might be able to do it. At night. I'll. Oh yeah, under the cover of darkness. I'll have a few cheeky swigs. Oh. So beautiful. Oh, yes. Eat the green poofiness. Okay, now all we need to do is just get close to the water and see what the situation's like. Oh, God. I'm in the open. Nothing can see me, right? Just stick to the trees. Oh. That was something. That sounded like a big herbivore. Just let me get across. I want to be on the good island. This is it. This is where I'm going to grow big and strong. Okay. Have a quick drink. Whoa. What was that? Was that a lightning strike and trees? And fire? Yeah, there we go. Oh, this is... Yes, this is paradise. I think there's there's lightning striking trees. The worst place to be is right next to the tree because if it gets struck by lightning, it can literally explode. Oh. oh, this is a terrifying night. Please don't. Yeah, if if a, if a tree, I was told ages ago, if a tree gets struck by lightning, it can explode and like all the bark can fire out as if like loads of little knives. Or maybe big knives. My god, what is round? Is. Oh! Is it like some sort of like volcano? I don't even know this map. That's bloody terrifying. It might be a geezer or something like that. Oh, that'd be so cool if they put those in. Please don't step on one, James, and blow yourself up. Well, whether I like it or not, I'm gonna have to get up and 
It's still raining. So hopefully I don't... Is it straight ahead? Yeah, there we go. Ooh, almost had a heart attack there. Thought I wasn't going to be... <laughs> I was going to die of hunger, ironically. Okay. Well, you know what? I may as well have some extra water just in case. While I can. Because you never know, a carnival might come by and I won't be able to drink again. So into the trees! <laughs> okay, okay, guys, guys, guys. Guys, guys, guys! That noise means that it's starting to become dawn. So what I need to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to adopt the tactics of the of a bear. And I'm just going to eat as much as I can right now and drink as much as I can and go into hibernation until I'm like a sub-adult or a, a young adult. You know what I mean. So quickly. Oh, you freaking serious. You know what? You know what it is. I actually have enough water and food to get me to a sub-adult. And those sounded like adult Utah Raptors. So instead of going out and risking being seen and killed when we've gotten so close yet again, I'm going to stay here and wait till I grow and then I'm going to go out. Come on, I don't want to waste the whole day sat down. It'll be night again. I've got to record and get good footage, damn it. What's with baby gallimimuses and squawking everywhere? <laughs> yes, 0.98. Come on, so close. 0.99, come on, I just wanna be big, please. Oh, I've waited so freaking long for this. <laughs> please, can I grow? 1.0, it's starting to get dark again. I can't believe I wasted the whole day doing nout. <laughs> come on, let me grow. Okay, you know what, sod it. I've got a drink. I gotta have something. Okay. Right, I don't see anything. That's good. Yes! 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 I am huge! Oh my god, I'm a fu- Am I fully grown? Oh, I'm not. Oh, I'm a juvie. Oh, and it is a hot spring we're at. So I've got to get even bigger than this. Oh, but now stuff like Ceratosaurus and that aren't a problem. <laughs> yes. The trike in the swamp is victorious. Although I still want to be worried about T-Rexes and stuff. They could pretty much end me in one hit. But now I have power. Yes. I mean, my only worry, really, is ambush. But this is a great place for uh, herbivores to be. This is awesome. Just trudging through. You know what it kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of Saurian. Yeah, it does a bit, actually. <laughs> and would you look at that? Guess what it's turning to? Yeah, it's night again. <laughs> God's sake. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's what I saw. So it wasn't lightning striking trees. It was just a geezer. At this size, I would say I'm pretty good at taking on anything, aren't I? I would hope so. As long as it's not maybe a fully grown Allosaur or a fully grown T-Rex. What is that? I guess I'll have something to drink, eh? I am on an official dev server. So I hope that no dev is like, you know what? I'm just gonna play as a bloody hypo and kill whoever's here. Whoa. Oh, it's a para. It's not being chased by anything, is it? Para. I think the para might have bolted. I did see it though, it was definitely there. Very mysterious place this because it's so big. There's not one, like, point of focus for everything going on. Well, you know what it is, guys. I think we're gonna end it here. And in the next episode, my god, it's gonna be way more entertaining, I think. <laughs> so I'm gonna lie down in these trees. 
We're definitely go Oh my god, it might be a while before we come become a fully grown adult, but um Does it go over time or are we gonna have to grow into it? I don't know because I know definitely like we grow in real time But I don't know whether like we sort of form into a adult triceratops. That's kind of a lot of work to do uh, I would assume but uh, yeah, anyway guys if you want to see more of this and the rest of the triceratops life Leave a like and until next time. I'll see you later Bye-bye